Hey everyone, in this tutorial, we're going to be going over how to create a custom email template in Mailgun using an email template created in Postcards. So in the Postcards app, I've created a template and it looks like this. And the first thing we want to do is we want to add Mailgun template variables in the Postcards interface because otherwise we would have to dig through the HTML code and make changes there. So just adding them in the mail or the postcards interface makes it easier. So mailgun template variables look like this. And what they do is they are the values or they represent the values of a particular subscriber in your when you send the email. So this recipient underscore F name would be replaced with their first name and the unsubscribe URL will be replaced with the actual URL to unsubscribe with. So we want to add these in the interface in this step just because it's easier. So what I will do is I will copy this and I want to add it to this title section. So I'll click into the header and that opens up the menu and I will open up title and I'll just add it here. So I'll type, Hey, template variable and press done. So this will be replaced with the recipient's first name when this email gets sent through Mailgun. And the second thing we want to do is update this link to be an unsubscribe link. So I'll click the footer, go to column two, and search for the text and URL. I'll copy this variable, replace this text with unsubscribe and paste in the URL. Now I'll press done. And that's all the changes we have to make in the postcards interface. Now I can export this file to get the HTML file to work with. So I'll press export, download as zip, and make sure you have the host images online option selected so you don't have to download and manually update the images yourself. I've already downloaded the zip and extracted it. It's here. So if I open this up, it's just the template that I created. And next we'll be going into Mailgun to create the email template. All right, so now I'm in the Mailgun dashboard and I want to create a template. So I'll press sending and then templates and then create message template and then select blank template. So I'll give it a name, a description and make sure your name doesn't have a capital letter in it because that's not a valid character and you won't be able to press create. So I want to add the postcards template code in this editor. So I will open up this index.html file in a text editor, highlight everything, and then paste it in here. Now I can press preview and see that it's the template I created in postcards. So now I'll press create. And at this point, the template is ready to go. And next I will send myself a test email to see what it looks like in Gmail. All right. So I sent myself a test email through a note script I created, and this is what was sent. As you can see, it's the postcards template. And you may notice that the variable for the first name isn't showing. This is because this was sent as a test to through a sandbox and not to a actual mailing list. So there is no value for the recipient's first name. But if you scroll to the bottom and you click unsubscribe, you can see that there is an actual unsubscribe link. And that will allow you to unsubscribe as well. So that was everything for this tutorial. And until next time, See you guys later.